This is the Primordial Caves, a cave from the Alex's Caves mod that adds a new underground biome full of prehistoric creatures. This entire world is a Primordial Cave, and let's just say it was not created for survival. This mod was originally made just to be a small part of a larger Minecraft world, and because of that, a lot of normal parts of Minecraft progression just doesn't generate. Animals don't spawn, villages don't spawn, normal mobs like zombies and creepers don't spawn naturally, and even normal stuff like stone or cobblestone just doesn't generate. So it's gonna be a challenge to say the least. But we have a few goals for today. First, I want to get iron, which actually does generate unlike cobblestone, but it's way rarer than it is in a normal world. I also want to build some sort of base with a farm so that we can get a consistent source of food and safety. And finally, I want to kill a T-Rex. I don't think there's a final boss in this mod. And the T-Rex is the biggest dinosaur in the caves. So I figured that's pretty much like killing the warden. But first we need to get down because we spawned this ledge at the top of the caves with nothing but a waterfall and a tree. I got some wood for tools, but when I looked to go down, I know something was waiting for me at the bottom. Dude, I gotta go down this way. It's the only way down. And there's a T-Rex camping me. What am I supposed to do here? If I go down, I don't know how fast they are. I don't want them to be able to outrun me or something. I don't want them to outrun me or something. I don't see... <gasps> there's iron right there. Okay, well, there's one, one goal already out of the way, but we don't have cobblestone, so we can't use it yet. Dude, there's two T-Rexes here, bro. I'm just gonna have to jump, I think, and run. Oh, there's a structure over there. Maybe we should go over that way. Let's go. Give me a lot of the water. Oh, I hear him coming. We saw that structure somewhere. I don't remember where we even was at. I need to run, but I don't have any food. Oh my gosh, what the F is that? <gasps> oh my gosh, ran into a big room full of velociraptor. Oh, I just ran into a big dinosaur. Maybe it's not gonna attack me though, I don't know. All right, we're in a safety spot here. <gasps> Oh my gosh, look, a structure. I dropped into the ruins and got some pretty useful stuff. When I was about to leave, I noticed someone or something was down here with me. Oh, there's a raptor out there. He didn't open the effing door, bruh. <gasps> Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Go away. Please go away, dude. <sighs> He's out of reach. Oh, 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 he can hit me from way over there. What the F, dude? Please don't let him go jump through there, dude. I'm cooked if he does. Did I kill him? Did he drop anything? Nope, just XP. Okay, we gotta run over here. Oh. <gasps> Oh my god, we found the jackpot. We finished looting the ruins and got a lot of food and also some invisible pants for some reason. And we went off to find some lava. If you're wondering why, I'll explain in a minute. But we found this volcano and I figured there had to be lava in there, right? Wrong! I climbed to the top just to find that there wasn't lava in it. It was like a lava block. There was this stuff that looked like lava but broke like a block. It was really weird. But either way, it's not gonna work. So I started looking around from the peak of the volcano and spotted some real flowing lava not too far from me. More importantly, it was right by a pool of water. Now, if you haven't figured it out already, let me explain it. If you haven't played Skyblock before, you may not know, but if you a bucket of water and a bucket of lava you can place them like this and create an infinite cobblestone generator but to get a bucket you need iron and to get iron we need stone and we can't get stone without a cobblestone generator so we need to find lava and water near each other and dig some sort of aqueduct to let them float into each other so we can finally get some stone i hear t-rexes all over dude this is scary lava needs to start flowing here dude oh geez the lava did not flow like at all is that mud we're in the water. <gasps> yes, dude. Yes, dude. Let's go. We got a cobblestone generator. Not exactly in the safest. Oh, jeez, dude. Are you freaking jorking me? Get out of here, Velociraptor. I'll just go back down. The Velociraptor walked away. I don't feel too unsafe now. It's still not safe. I need to build like a box around myself while I collect cobble. Okay. <gasps> oh, it went that way. Oh, dude. It's like eating it up. <laughs> Oh, what the F? I don't know why, it's like just eating it up. Dude, it keeps eating it, bro. How am I gonna get this to flow better? Our cobblestone generator did not last us very long. We're gonna need to take this. Now we're gonna need to go find that iron that we saw before. Make some ish happen out of it. Is there something out there? Oh, 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 oh my gosh, why did I do that? Okay, let's just, for now. Is there some ish out there? Oh, that. Okay, we can see. Okay, there's nothing out there. We're fine. We're ch ch, ch chilling. Now that we had a stone pickaxe, we could finally get some iron. So I went back to spawn to get the iron I spotted at the beginning. There's only three iron ore, which was fine, because I only really need a bucket. But as soon as I turned around, I realized we actually need... Oh, we gotta go back and get the freaking cobblestone for a furnace. I saw a Velociraptor. I think he might have seen me too. I don't like that. So I had to go all the way back to our janky ass cobblestone generator. So I could get eight more cobble and make a furnace. What in the world is going... <gasps> oh, oh, oh. Oh, what the f dude i made the furnace and smelted the iron and just like that our first goal today was finally completed i made a bucket for lava and grabbed some bone from this ruin and went off to find a spot for our base i wanted to find somewhere high off the ground so no raptors or t-rexes can get to us so the first spot i looked was up here with this pterodactyl 
That guy makes weird noises. He seems chill though. But I decided this wasn't right when a raptor immediately started making his way up to me. Last raptor coming. I'm gonna try an ancient technique. Dude, the lava's not gonna go hit him. Oh, but it's just taking its time. Okay. <gasps> it's working. It's working so well. The ancient technique, bro. Before I went off to find a better spot, I made a game-changing discovery. Actually, I think I can feed you this and you become my friend. <gasps> Prehistoric elytra. Oh! Oh, this is awesome now, dude. Okay. Now that I had a safer and faster way to get around, I could really find some top-notch property. And after some looking and testing of different areas, I decided the safest spot would be at the ledge we spawned in at. This is where we're gonna build our life. How do I get him to stay? Okay. Oh. Oh, he's following. I want him to stay. There we go. There we go. He's staying. I right, such a great boy. All right, we're way up here now, so we should stay safe when we're up here. Okay, this up here is dirt that we can build our farm on. Which is what we're gonna do. Oh, we don't have water, dude. We don't have water. If I remember correctly from when we spawned in, there is like a little pool right here. Yeah, there's a T-Rex right by it. All right, we're gonna make a little spot for us to put our lava so we don't like worry about it like burning up. All right, the lava's gonna stay right there. Hopefully it doesn't burn anything. Come here, man. Oh, oh, oh no. We lost our club. We got our food back, and our bucket back, and our furnace back, and our pickaxe back. We got pretty much everything important. We just lost our club, pretty much. We just need to get our water. So let's go way over here. We need to get this water and get the F out of here before... Dude, they're all closing in on us. This is bad. This is bad. I thought he was going after us. Okay. All right, here's one water. Right, we're going to make our unlimited water source right here. Come on, man. We got to go back down. Oh my god, I didn't even see that guy. Oh jeez, there's two T-Rexes right here. He's freaking out. Oh, 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 oh. oh my gosh, he started coming after me. Sorry for sounding like that. Perfect. And we got unlimited water. Perfect. And we can take our lava bucket back. All right, I don't know how to make a cobblestone generator to keep it a stack. I don't know how to keep do that without messing it up. So I'm gonna have to look up a video probably. One down right there. Water goes there. And the lava goes here. Yes! Yes, dude. Oh yeah, we got a cobblestone generator. This is great. This is magnificent. We are getting so much cobblestone here. I mean, half of it's getting burnt. So, you know, we're not getting like all of the cobblestone, but we're getting so much of it that this is pretty awesome. Okay, we are in a good situation now. All right, we need to start making a farm. How much dirt do we have? We don't have like any dirt. Okay, cool. You don't have a name for this guy. He'll just be called bro forever. So me and bro will probably have to go down and get some dirt from somewhere without dying. We started collecting dirt and put together a farm. We only had two seeds and lost all the bones for bone meal when we died, so the plot's gonna stay empty for now. We also made a small, tiny decision that our ledge was too small and we needed to move. And I decided the best plan was to clear out that sandstone and build my house there. An entirely unique idea I had. But I wanted to get some food in order first, so I went off to find new bones for bone meal and farm some wheat before moving. Once I made the move, we absolutely mowed down the sandstone and used the slabs of it for our flooring. And before you say anything, <laughs> I'm not much of a builder, so don't expect too much. Here's our little area. We need to make a small platform off on the edges for like a farm and for our cobblestone generator. Shut up, I'm trying to speak. That dinosaur that just rudely interrupted me, he's our final enemy. Because remember, our final goal today is to kill a T-Rex. And this is the one we're taking down or trying to. I don't know, we have other stuff to worry about first. I put a wood outline around our platform with a sandstone wall on top. I also built a helicopter pad type platform for bro to land on because we still had to go back and forth from our old base to get the rest of our stuff. I rebuilt the farm at the new base and I did it perfectly the first time, I promise. This is uneven. This is uneven. We did this wrong. How did I not realize I did this wrong? So I fixed the farm and I planted some wheat seeds and dug down the middle to make a cobblestone generator room in the base. Hopefully this works. Let's see. Yes, dude. Oh, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And just like that, the base is done, pretty much. I still need to make a door, but I want to do it right by the T-Rex, so we might have to start a final battle while building the door. We have everything we could ever need. All we need is the way out of the house. Come on, bro. I want to see, we gotta come down here. I want to see what exactly the ground level is, which is definitely not safe with this T-Rex right here, but we need to make our way out eventually, or some way or another. This looks so weird. Oh, I have not looked at this yet. We're going to go down to... down to... negative 16, facing west. That's what we're going to do. We need more, uh... ladders. We're going to negative 16. So yeah, we only need... Nine. I want to make the door right here, but I know the T-Rex is right here, which is incredibly concerning. Yeah, he's right there. That is awesome. Dude, you can't even do anything when he's roaring. He doesn't even want me. Oh! He can't get up here. Alright, well that was not enough to kill him, which means he's gonna survive. <laughs> Dude, 
we were cheesing him. Here, let's try. That's not what I wanted to do. Oh shit, we should back out while we have a chance. We have a second, back out. I want to do, not that, this. We're finally gonna be able to slay a dinosaur. It's not gonna slay a dinosaur. Did this guy ever die? <gasps> ah, ah! We should have blocks ready. Dude, this guy's infinite HP. Yeah, just stay right here, sir. I'll be right back for you. We don't have a lot that we can make a sword out of, so it's just gonna have to be stone. Dude, get- Oh! He's right up here! He got up here! Uh, uh, he's right behind me, isn't he? Ah! 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 